Hi, in this tutorial I'll show you how you can create text in perspective in Inkscape and I'll also add some effects to make this look more interesting. Let's zoom out and delete all this. Now the first thing I'll do is go to the text tool, click here, write Inkscape. F1 to grab the Select and Transform tool, holding down the Control key, I make this bigger. Now I'll click on the text tool here and select another font. Let's say this one, make it a little bit bigger. Also change the color to red. Now the next thing I'll do is grab the Bezier tool and starting from the left bottom, I'll click, then holding down the control key to get a straight line, I'll click again. Then I'll release the control key and create something like this. Click, again holding down the control key to get a straight line. Click, and then click here. Now I'm gonna grab this tool to modify this a little bit, like this. And uh, next, select the text, path, object to path, and click with the shift key on this object. Go to extensions, modify path, perspective. And you see the result here. Now we can click on this and delete it. Now to get this text to go like this, like I said, you need to create the path with the Bezier tool starting from the left bottom and then continue like this, otherwise you may get the text to go in a different direction. Now let's create another text here, again Inkscape, F1, control key to make this bigger. Text tool, select another font, and again the Bezier tool, and this time I'll make the left part of the path bigger and the right smaller. So let's click here. Again, let's select the text, object to path. If you don't uh, turn this object into a path, this won't work, so you need to do this. Shift key, click on this. Extensions, modify path, perspective. And you see the result. Again, let's select the path and remove it. Now let's add some background. Move this to the bottom. Also change the color to this one. And let's move it a little bit over here. And I'll also select this text go to filters, bevels, stained glass and this one I'll go to filters, bevels, button now let's zoom in you can also edit here with the filter editor bit. Now the next thing I'll do is grab again the Bezier tool, click here, then I'll click over here, click again, F1 to select this and I'll move it a little bit down like this. Next I'll go to this tool, make the stroke white and the stroke style here with a winter 5 and here on blur I'll do something like this let's close this and uh, let's move this down to be behind the text but above the background now this is not going in the perfect line here so I'm going to grab this tool and adjust it a little bit
okay this looks better now I'm gonna do the same thing here but before that maybe we can add a little bit more blur here let's say 7 click enter to apply and this looks a little bit better now let's do this here click you have to double click to complete the path and then again I'll go here white cover close this and move this one step down so you see how fast and easy we created text in perspective and also added some effects using filters and some of the other options here so that's it for this tutorial bye for now